First and tonight, protesters are fired up over what could be taught in classrooms. Three new school board members signed the 1776 pledge. They now vow to restore, quote, honest, patriotic education. KCCI's Lauren Johnson is live in Johnson tonight with the problems this curriculum change could pose. That's right, Steve. This same initiative sets to dismantle critical race theory and the 1619 project, and some fear that this could be very harmful to students in the district. A peaceful march kicked off a long night for the Johnston School Board. Students and community members organized in opposition of a controversial pledge new board members made ahead of the school board election. We really don't want this curriculum to be where we no longer have critical race theory in schools, where we are no longer talking about these important um, things that surround the BIPOC community. Deb Davis, Clint Evans, and Derek Tidball all were sworn in on Monday night's meeting. All three members signed the 1776 Project Pledge, a pledge that aims to push for patriotism and pride in American history in school curriculums. We just understand the uniqueness and the greatness of our country. So I've supported that my whole life, and I think uh, a curriculum that, that paints a picture for the students of a world they want to be a part of is important to inspire them to go out and be part of that. Board members share they believe the main objective of the 1776 project isn't to forget the turbulent past of America, but to put an emphasis on unity and the triumphs of the country. This is how things you know, have gone on in the past. These are things that have happened. They're real, but we're all working together to get to the bed, you know, to the top of the mountain. And that's that's how I look at it. The pledge also sets to overturn critical race theory and the 1619 project, both seen as divisive topics by the Iowa legislature. Some felt the new perspective could oppress students of color in the district. What is the morality behind pushing years of systemic racism, hatred and injustice back into the past and ignoring it and teaching students to move on and to forget? Others felt these new members deserve some understanding and consideration. I know that you're here and you're angry. The only way we learn about each other is by having the conversations. The main goal from students to take into consideration of the many backgrounds of the Johnston student body before making any new decisions. We just want all of the school board members to denounce this pledge as harmful towards education. Um, ideally, we would like the signatures that are already there to be removed and for them to take a different stance. That's right. So a lot of things to consider for the Johnston School Board tonight. Right now, there isn't any word on when or if this new curriculum will be implemented in their classrooms. Reporting live in Johnston, Lauren Johnson, KCCI News, Iowa's News